Hey, what's up guys? I got some more Battlefield 3 news for you guys today. Some great Battlefield news, as a matter of fact. Uh, a lot of you guys have been asking me about the patch and when it's going to be coming out, and I haven't had any specific information. However, I do have some great news for you guys today, and that is that uh, even though there's still no definite, specific ETA about when the patch is coming, a specific date, and uh, so on and so forth, uh, the patch has been submitted to the certification process that Microsoft and Sony do. And for those of you guys who don't know, the certification process takes about two weeks. So that means that most likely we will be seeing the patch being released on all platforms by the end of March. Which is much better than the time frame that they gave us, which was basically just spring. Because a lot of people were thinking that they were going to release the patch uh, like hand in hand with the DLC coming out in June. Which is what they did with the Back to Carcan uh expansion pack if you guys remember back in december there was a patch released right before the back to car can expansion pack hit and a lot of people thought that they were going to do the same thing for this one however it's been submitted to the certification process and we should be seeing it by the end of march also for those of you guys who have been experiencing issues with some of the weapons that came with the back to car can expansion for example if you use the type 95 uh, your character will basically have its hands in the air like over his head looking like he's about to break down to do a Shakira dance uh, and you couldn't use the weapon really because you can't see the iron sights, you can't see the weapon itself and you had no crosshairs so trying to kill people with, with that was like trying to shoot a tick on a mule's ass it was really impossible, really difficult to do it so for those of you guys who want to fix this you're going to have to re-download the Back to Karkin expansion it's not a patch, it's they basically republished the Back to Karkin expansion pack um, as a patched version of it that fixes those issues so it's a big file so get ready to take some time downloading that and for those of you guys with the weak connections I would suggest downloading it overnight that way you know it doesn't interfere with your game time during the day so that's all the Battlefield 3 info I got for you guys today I know it wasn't a ton of info but I had to get this out it was very important that you guys know about the certification process the back to car can update and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it informative and if you did don't forget to click that like button it definitely does help out my channel it shows your support it shows that you want more so on and so forth and if you really enjoyed it clicking that favorite button is the way to go and sharing this video using the share button below the video definitely does help as well so hope you guys enjoyed till next time peace